Hello everybody and welcome to my ELSN. I'm your guru and in this video I'll tell you how to create beautiful looking visual in-cell indicators in Excel. So these are these lines which will expand or contract based on the value in the cell. You see 88 is having a longish line, 96 is having an even longer line and compare see what has what 25 has to show for that let's change let's make it one see let's make it 56 so this is how this is what I'm going to teach you today how to create this so to create this uh, we'll be creating it through conditional formatting so let's first remove this all right so to remove any conditional formatting like this we have to select the area which we want to remove the conditional formatting from and then go to clear rules under this section and cl click on clear rules from selected cell all right so now we select the area where we want to apply the conditional formatting go to conditional formatting in the home tab and go to color data bars and in the data bars there is one way of either just selecting any color that you want like this all right and having the data bars created or there is a better way which is even more precise wherein we go to more rules and here we change the minimum to a number you can use a person formula percentile and the maximum also to a number and the minimum let it be zero and the maximum let it be hundred in our case it the maximum would be hundred if, if in if for a change in your data set the numbers are even higher you can apply that value over here and you can select the color from here say let's select a green color and let's select a gradient fill all right and in case you want to show the data bars only without the numbers you just click over here and the numbers would not be visible only the data bar would be visible and you click on OK so this is how the in cell indicators can be created so very simple so very nice right now we can even edit the conditional formatting done over here we want to change the color we will we select this area we go to conditional formatting and we go to manage rules we double click it you want to change the color you change the color over here see let's choose a light blue and you want to show the bar only just click over here click OK click apply and you see the numbers are gone the bar only the bar is visible however if you click on the bar double click on the bar in the cell you'll see the number the number would always be visible in the formula bar also So this is, I just undid whatever I did so that we can have the numbers back. So I hope you like this video. So until the next video, this is your guru now signing off for the day. Don't forget to go to myelesson.org to download these, this file and watch hundreds of more such videos. Take care. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning.